Now what is A? A, B, C are nothing but the coefficient of x, y and the constant. Any equation of the forum AX plus BY plus C is equal to zero where A and B are not zeros is called general equation of a line. What is the intercept forum of a straight line? X by A plus Y by B is equal to one. Just keep 3x plus 10 as it is and transfer minus 4y to the right hand side, it becomes plus 4y. Hello dear students, welcome to this session of mathematics class. I am Mr. Niranjan, faculty department of mathematics with Ashram PU College, the temple of excellence. In my previous class, we have discussed regarding different equation of straight lines and the problems based on that. Now today I am going to discuss regarding the general equation, general form of equation of a straight line and the problems based on that. Now let us know the general equation of the line and the transformation of general equation into different forms. So let us discuss first the general equation of line. Now any equation of the forum AX plus BY plus C is equal to zero where A and B are not zeros is called general equation of a line. So A and B are not zeros. AX plus BY plus C is equal to zero will always represent the general equation of a line where A and B are not zeros, right? So we can also write like this, AX plus BY plus C is equal to zero is the general equation of a straight line. For example, example, any equation like 2X plus 3Y plus 4 is equal to zero is a general equation of a line where what is A here? A is nothing but the coefficient of X. And what is uh, B? B is nothing but the coefficient of Y. And what is C? C is the constant. Right. Now, similarly, one more example, another example, 3x minus 2y plus 5 is equal to 0. This is also an equation of the forum ax plus by plus c is equal to 0, the general equation where a is equal to 3, b is equal to minus 2, and c is equal to 5. We can also write like this, root 3x plus 2y plus root 2 is equal to 0. This is also an equation of the forum ax plus by plus c is equal to 0. Now what is a? a, b, c are nothing but the coefficient of x, y and the constant. So a is equal to coefficient of x is 3, b is equal to coefficient of y is 2 and c is equal to constant root 2. So these are few examples for a general equation of a line. So general equation of a line is always of the forum ax plus by plus c is equal to 0. These are few examples. Now, let us know regarding the transformation of general equation in different standard forum. So, the general equation of the line can be transformed into different equations of the forums. So, that we have studied in the last class, that is different forums. So, how we are going to convert a general equation ax plus by plus c into different forums like uh, slope intercept forum, two point forum, normal forum, then uh, intercept forum and uh, different forms. So let us know regarding the transformation of the equation ax plus by plus c is equal to zero in slope intercept forum y is equal to mx plus c. Now just divide by c or if you divide by b enough. So just divide by b. So convert the given equation ax plus by plus c is equal to zero into y is equal to mx plus c means just divide through it by the coefficient of y. What is the coefficient of y? b. So divide this equation by b. What we will get? So ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 can also be written as a by bx plus by plus c by b that is y is equal to transfer this. So what you will get? Minus a by x plus minus c by b is the equation of the line in the intercept forum where m is equal to m is equal to minus a by b and the y c is equal to c is equal to minus c by b, right. So this is of the forum y is equal to mx plus c where m is equal to minus a by b the coefficient of x by coefficient of y and the y intercept is given by c is equal to minus constant term divided by the coefficient of y. So therefore any equation of the forum ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 can be written as y is equal to minus a by b x a by b x plus 
minus of c by b c by b so therefore if you compare this with y is equal to mx plus c m is equal to minus a by b is called the slope this is the slope m is equal to minus a by b is the slope in this case let us go to the next one next forum that is transformation of ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 into intercept forum what is the intercept forum of a straight line x by a plus y by b is equal to 1 so x intercept is a and y intercept is b x by a plus y by b is equal to 1 now how to convert this ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 into intercept forum just divide through out by minus c so transfer this equation ax plus by plus c will becomes minus c if we divide throughout by minus c term by term division so what you will get x ax divided by minus c plus by divided by minus c divided is equal to minus c by c is plus 1 so that can also be written as x divided by minus c by a plus y divided by minus c by b is equal to 1 is the equation so that means x intercept is that is the intercept on the x axis is given by minus c by a that is minus constant term divided by coefficient of x and the intercept on the y axis is given by minus c by b that is minus constant term divided by coefficient of y now let us consider for example let me take one example if 2x plus 3y minus 6 is equal to 0 now how to convert this this is the forum ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 now how to convert this into intercept forum 2x plus 3y minus 6 becomes plus 6 transfer minus 6 to the right hand side now just make this 6 as 1 for that divide by 6 on both sides if you divide by 6 2x by 6 plus 3y by 6 is equal to 6 by 6 2 3s are gets cancelled 3 2s are gets cancelled 6 by 6 gets cancelled so therefore x by 3 plus y by 2 is equal to 1 so this is of the forum x by a plus y by b is equal to 1 right what is a a is nothing but the x intercept a is equal to 3 what is b b is the y intercept that is equal to 2 a is equal to 3 and b is equal to 2 this is how we are going to find the intercept so any equation ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 can be converted into the intercept forum by dividing throughout by converting the right hand constant as 1 so x by minus c by a plus y by minus c by b is equal to 1 is the intercept forum of a straight line now let us discuss regarding one more transformation that is transformation of ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 in the normal forum that is x cos omega plus y sin omega is equal to p or we can also write x into cos alpha plus y into sin alpha is equal to p. p is the perpendicular distance from the origin. Alpha or omega are the angle between the perpendicular line and the origin. Now, so divide both the sides of the equation by root of a square plus b square. What is a and b? a and b are the coefficient of x and y. So just take root of a square plus b square divide both sides by root of a square plus b square so what you will get so transfer this uh, ax to the left hand side and bx to by to the left hand side then it becomes minus ax minus by is equal to c so therefore x into minus a by root of a square plus b square plus y into minus b by root of a square plus b square is equal to plus or minus c by root of a square plus b square where of cos omega this is of the forum if you compare this is of the forum x into cos omega plus y into sin omega is equal to p what is cos omega cos omega is equal to yes minus a by root of a square plus b square and sin omega is equal to minus b by root of a square plus b square and p is equal to plus or minus c by root of a square plus b square let us take one small example let us consider an example x plus y minus 1 is equal to 0 now convert this x plus y minus 1 is equal to 0 into the normal forum so how to convert this into the normal forum now this can be written as x plus y is equal to plus 1 now comparing with the standard equation ax plus by is equal to c what is a a is 1 what is b b is 1 so take root of a square plus b square 
root of a square plus b square is equal to 1 plus 1 is equal to root 2. That means divide this equation by root 2. So if you divide by root 2, what you will get? x by root 2 plus y by root 2 is equal to 1 by root 2. So this can be written as x into 1 by root 2 plus y into 1 by root 2 is equal to 1 by root 2. Now this is nothing but x into cos of 45 degrees plus y into sin of 45 degrees is equal to 1 by root 2. So if you observe carefully this is of the form x cos alpha plus y sin alpha is equal to p. What is alpha here? In this case alpha is equal to 45 and p is equal to 1 by root 2. So you can call it as omega also. So omega or alpha angle is equal to 45 degrees and p is equal to 1 by root 2. This is how we are going to solve these type of problems. So hope you followed. Now based on this let us take few examples. Now if the equation of a line is 3x minus 4y plus 10 is equal to 0, find its slope and x and y intercept. Now let us find out the slope. So the slope of the line, slope of ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 is m is equal to minus a by b, right. Now what is given here? 3x minus 4y plus 10 is equal to 0. So a is equal to 3, b is equal to minus 4. So therefore the slope m is equal to minus a minus 3 divided by minus 4 that is equal to 3 by 4 that is it. The slope of the line is 3 by 4 or we can also solve like this. What is the given equation? 3x minus 4y plus 10 is equal to 0. What is required to find is convert this into the form y is equal to mx plus c. So 3x and transfer plus 10 becomes uh, this plus 10 as it is 3x plus 10 is equal to transfer plus 4y to the right hand side it becomes minus 4y becomes plus 4y. Just keep 3x plus 10 as it is and transfer minus 4y to the right hand side it becomes plus 4y divide by 4. If you divide by 4 what happens 3 by 4 into x plus 10 by 4, 10 by 4 is nothing but 5 by 2 is equal to y. So this is nothing but y is equal to 3 by 4 times x plus 5 by 2 comparing with y is equal to mx plus c. So therefore what is the slope? m is equal to 3 by 4, that is all, this is the slope. This is the another method. This is by formula method, this is by converting into slope intercept forum. Now, Second concept, what are the x and y intercepts? So here straight away you can write the x and y intercept by converting into the intercept form x by a plus y by b is equal to 1. Now what is given? This is given 3x minus 4y and transfer plus 10 to the right hand side it becomes minus 10. Divide throughout by minus 10. So what you will get minus 3x divided by 10 minus into minus plus 4y divided by 10 plus 1. So this can be written as x divided by minus 10 by 3 plus y divided by 10 by 4 is equal to 1. So therefore you can say x intercept, x intercept is a is equal to minus 10 by 3 and y intercept, y intercept b is equal to 10 by 4 or it is also equal to 5 by 2. So the x intercept is minus 10 by 3 and the y intercept is 5 by 2, that is it, okay. Now let us take one more example, another example 3x plus 2y minus 2 1 is equal to 0. Now let us find out the slope for this. So comparing with ax plus by plus c is equal to 0. So a is equal to 3, b is equal to 2. The slope m is equal to minus a by b. So therefore m is equal to minus a by b. What is minus of a is 3, b is 2, minus 3 by 2 is the slope. Now what is the intercept of this? So this equation can be written as 3x plus 2y is equal to 12. Divide throughout by 12. What you will get? 
थ्री एक्स बाई ट्वेल्व प्लस टू वाई बाई ट्वेल्व इज इक्वल टू ट्वेल्व बाई ट्वेल्व सो थ्री फोर जा गेट्स कैंसल टू सिक्स जा गेट्स कैंसल ट्वेल्व बाई ट्वेल्व सो एक्स बाई फोर प्लस वाई बाई सिक्स इज इक्वल टू वन सो कंपेयरिंग विथ एक्स बाई ए प्लस वाई बाई बी इज इक्वल टू वन सो देर फोर ए इज इक्वल टू फोर एंड बी इज इक्वल टू सिक्स दीज आर द इंटरसेप्ट एक्स एंड वाई इंटरसेप्ट दैट्स इट ओके द स्लोप कैन ऑल्सो बी डिटरमाइंड यूजिंग सो कन्वर्ट इन टू द स्लोप इंटरसेप्ट फॉरम सो दैट इज जस्ट कीप टू वाई एर इट्स टू वाई इज इक्वल टू माइनस टू बिकम्स प्लस ट्वेल्व एंड प्लस थ्री एक्स बिकम्स माइनस थ्री एक्स नाउ डिवाइड बाई टू ऑन बोर्ड साइड्स वाई इज इक्वल टू ट्वेल्व बाई टू माइनस थ्री बाई टू इंटू एक्स सो वाई इज इक्वल टू ट्वेल्व बाई टू इज सिक्स माइनस इंटू प्लस इट इज माइनस थ्री बाई टू टाइम्स एक्स सो जस्ट पुट इट इन द स्टैंडर्ड फॉरम माइनस थ्री बाई टू इंटू एक्स प्लस सिक्स सो कंपेरिंग विथ y is equal to m x plus c you can write the slope m is equal to minus 3 by 2 see they are same any method you can follow to find the slope either by conversion method or by direct formula method okay now move on to the next problem reduce the following equation 4x minus 3y is equal to 6 same problem using intercept forum Now same type. Reduce the following equation into intercept form. 4x minus 3y is equal to 6. Find x and y intercept. Very simple problem it is. Now what is the given equation? 4x minus 3y is equal to 6. Divide by 6 on both sides. 4x by 6 minus 3y by 6 is equal to 6 by 6. Now this can be done as x divided by 6 by 4 minus y divided by 6 by 3 is equal to 1. So this is x divided by six by four. This is plus minus y divided by six by three is equal to one. So you can write a is equal to the x-intercept a is equal to six by four means three by two, and b is equal to coefficient of this that is equal to minus six by three that is equal to minus two. So x-intercept is three by two. This is x intercept x intercept this is equal to y intercept that's it okay now suppose if you want to find the slope for this line what is the slope slope of this line is minus a by b what is minus a by b minus 4 divided by minus 3 So minus and minus gets cancelled. Slope is equal to four by three. That's it. Okay, right. Let us take one more example. Three y plus two is equal to zero. Okay. Now this can be written as rewrite this. Three y is equal to minus two. Divide by minus two. What you will get? Y by three y by minus two is equal to plus one. So this can be done as y divided by minus two by three is equal to one. Comparing with x by a plus y by b is equal to one. So x intercept, x intercept, x intercept is a that is equal to zero because there is no x intercept and we have only y intercept. Y intercept that is b is equal to what is y intercept minus two by three. That's it. So y intercept is minus two by three. Okay, so there is no x intercept. We have only y intercept. Now to find the slope, convert this. So that is to find the slope, three y plus two is equal to zero. So three y is equal to minus two. Y is equal to minus two by three. Comparing with y is equal to m x plus c. Here no slope. X intercept is zero. So M is equal to zero and C is equal to minus two by three. That's it. Okay. This is how we are going to solve this type of problem. Now move on to the next type of problem. That is, reduce the equation root three x plus y minus eight is equal to zero into normal form. Find the values of p and w. Now that is omega. Now you know what is the normal form of a line. Normal form of a line is normal form is x into cos omega 
plus y into sin omega is equal to p. Now, what is the equation given here? The given equation is root 3x plus y minus 8 is equal to 0 or root 3x plus y is equal to 8. Now, comparing with the standard equation, a is equal to root 3, b is equal to 1. Get the value of root of a square plus b square. What is root of a square plus b square? Root 3 whole square is 3. 1 square is 1. 3 plus 1 is 4. That is equal to square of 4 is 2. Now, divide by 2. Divide by 2. Equation number 1. Given equation. Let us call it as equation number 1. Divide by 2. 1 equation is divided by 2. What you will get? Root 3 by 2x plus 1 by 2y is equal to 8 by 2. That is equal to p. Now, this can also be written as x into cos omega plus y into sin omega is equal to p. Now, therefore, what do you say? p is equal to 4 and omega is nothing but cos omega is root 3. Cos omega is equal to root 3 by 2 and sin omega is equal to 1 by 2. So, for what value of omega, sin becomes 1 by 2 and cos becomes root 3 by 2. So, therefore, omega is equal to, you know, 30 degrees, sin 30, 1 by 2, cos 30 is equal to root 3 by 2, omega is equal to 30 degrees, omega is equal to 30 degrees. So, here p is equal to 4 and omega is equal to 30 degree or alpha is equal to 30 degree. That is it. Hope you followed. So, therefore, this equation can be written as the given equation becomes x into cos 30 degree plus y into sin 30 degrees is equal to 4. This is the normal equation of the given line. That is it. Okay. Hope you followed. Okay. Now, let us take one more example. Phi, yes. Reduce the equation. Let us convert, take one more example. Y minus 2 is equal to 0. Example number 2. Y minus 2 is equal to 0. Now, how to convert this y minus 2 is equal to 0 into the normal form? So, what is the value of a? a is equal to 0, b is equal to 1. So, get the value of root of a square plus b square. Root of a square plus b square is 0 plus 1 is equal to 1. Divide this equation by 1. So, what you will get? So, that is this equation can also be written as y is equal to 2. So, y divided by 1 is equal to 2 by 1. So, this y by 2 is nothing but y. y is equal to 2. So, this can be written as x into cos of cos of 0 plus y sin 0 is equal to 2. So, therefore, this equation can also be written as, therefore, this equation can be written as x into 0 plus y into 1 is equal to 2. So, what is the value of p? p is equal to 2. Now, if you observe carefully, this is of the forum x into cos 90 plus y into sin 90 degrees is equal to 2. Since you know what is sin 90? sin 90 is 1, cos 90 is equal to 0. So, 0 into x is 0 plus y into 1 is y. So, therefore, you can write omega is equal to 90 degrees. P is equal to 2 and omega is equal to 90 degrees. That is, alpha or omega is 90 degree and the perpendicular distance is 2. That is it. This is how we are going to solve this type of problems. Hope you followed. Okay. So, these are few problems based on the conversion of uh, the general equation ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 into different forums and solving the problems. That is a very important concept. So, that is all regarding today's session. Let us meet with a different concept in the next session. Thank you. Thank you very much.